Hi everybody, it's me, Miss P, the American Rebel. I'm doing this this last one, I promised last one. Um, but this is, I think, the most important one to tie everything together. So if you've not seen all the other videos about control, you know, about, con you know, um, tools for control and all that for our freedom of speech and all that in this series, I just check it out. They're very, very cool. Uh, the one thing is let our voice be heard. You know, at one time we were a barbaric country and we let our voice be heard. We were sexist. We were piggish. We said things racial. We said things whatever. And we all let it fly through. Let it fly. We all let it handle it. And even though we were offended, greatly offended, and there was no buffer for any of that, ladies and gentlemen, we were, you know, it all handled. I'm not talking about that because, you know, of course, we all don't want to be, we don't, we all don't want to see all, see racial slurs and sexist slurs and sex terms out there. We don't want to see, we don't want to see people expose themselves and we don't want to see, and we don't want to see people truly just mal maliciously hurting each other. Okay, we don't, we don't want to see that and if it's directly at it. I would say this, from the community guidelines to the control and all that, let your voice be heard. I don't care if you're Democrat or Republican. If you're a Democrat and you're a crazy woke person, a crazy woke socialist person, let your voice be heard as long as you're respectful. I'm sure I won't pay attention to you because I know you're be I know I'm no better. But let your voice be heard. Sure you may be a, 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 a sure you may be a, a, a environmentalist person or a whatever or whatever, you know. Let your voice be heard. Sure, you support conservatism. Let your voice be heard, as long as as long as it's within respectable guidelines that everyone follows. That everyone follows and stays stagnant. Everyone deserves to be heard. Everyone deserves to show news and then to take what they have and process it in their head. Everyone deserves this. That's what makes America the America. The greatest country in the world. And as long as you let your voice be heard and you go along the guidelines of what's respectable, there's no reason why our freedom of speech should ever be restricted. There should be no other reason why it should be restricted. Yet, we're allowing it to happen by the Democrat Party and the socialist community. Why are we allowing this? Why are our, our voices not heard? Why are we not letting our voices speak? Because we're allowing it ourselves. And we're allowing others to take control of these, these, these controls and these gauges so that we are not heard.